Hey Unbreakable, here we are again today uh, with another tip from Sports Performance. As kids are making and athletes are making the transition back from this quarantine period, people are going to want to push weight really quick. They want to show that they've made gains, they want to get stronger, um, they want to try and make up for missed time. But one of the things that you really need to focus on as you're getting ready to get back into the weight room and, and when you first get back in the weight room, and something that should also be extremely important to your everyday workout programming is core development. And too many people neglect their core and that sets them up for injuries later on down the road or even very early on. Bad strength or weakness in our core also leads us to weak gains in every other lift. Bad squat, bad clean, bad snatch, bad bench, poor running technique can all be tied to a weak core. And when I talk about core, everybody automatically thinks our abdominal muscles. We need to be doing sit-ups and crunches and flutter kicks and all those things, those are great. But we also need to work our oblique muscles on our sides and our lower back. It works like an overall corset. And so what you really need to focus on is you're coming back from this break that we've had, where you've been trained at home, or maybe limited your training. Really focus now on your core. Develop a strong core. Other things will come together very quickly for you. So my big thing today with sports performance is this. Build your core. Don't ever stop building your core. And if you're ever injured or you have something else that's going to limit your training, make sure that the thing that you focus on is your core development. A strong core will make you a better athlete, a faster athlete, and a more explosive athlete. Thanks for joining us today on Breakable Athletics. See you next week.